Hi everyone. So this uh, morning, Wednesday morning, I was at the Focus breakfast served out of Westminster's Hall every Wednesday. I'm always there hanging out, talking to people. And I talked to a guy I didn't know this morning. He introduced himself to me and he told me his name. It is the same name as a political hero of mine. And uh, it immediately caught my interest and I asked him about it. I asked him why he had that name, who gave him that name. I said, oh, your parents must be very political. And he said, oh yeah, no, I never knew my mom and uh, my dad's passed. And I, I really don't know why I have this name, but I've been investigating the story of the person I've been named after. We had an interesting conversation about that person, his uh, namesake, and uh, that person's work and life and legacy. And it really got me thinking about how important it is for each of us, for all of us, to kind of know the story of our name, to know why we're called what we're called. I, that's a, sometimes a icebreaker used in groups. Rosa, my daughter, who's been working with a trail crew all summer, uh, told me that she tried it out on her group and she said, mom, I was the only one who knew the story of my name. Rosa's also named after a political hero of ours. <laughs> well, listen, this Sunday, we're going to continue the conversation that we started this past Sunday. Um, that is a little political. It's about how we're navigating, how we're understanding some of the political divisions in our country right now in which Christians are very seriously implicated. And we talked about the need to make distinctions, to make a, a division between us and them last Sunday. And I promised that this Sunday we would have a more constructive conversation about how to reconcile, how to build connections, how to heal some divisions. It's a harder sermon to preach, but I'm helped in part by thinking about the names that we call each other and where those names come from and what it would mean to call each other by a different name, a name with a deeper root, a name with a different origin. Let's think about that together on Sunday and maybe in preparation, you'll think about the story of your name and of all the names you've ever been called. I'll see you Sunday.